Question 2. Nitric acid can be made in three stage process. Okay, stage 1. Ammonia is oxidized by the oxygen from the air to form nitrogen monoxide and water. So you have to construct the equation in part A using this info. Okay, write an equation for the stage 1. So you just put ammonia with O2 from NO and water. After that, you just balance it. So you get this equation. Okay, part B. Draw a dot and cross diagram for the arrangement of outer electrons only in the molecules of ammonia. So ammonia, we know that is NH3. First, you need to make sure the total electrons involved is NH3 N will contribute 5 electron H will contribute 3 electron so you must make sure your dot and cross diagram total outer electrons is 8 okay, so nitrogen it has 5 valence electron so it's going to share 3 of the electrons with the hydrogen so therefore, you form three bonding, three pair of electrons, and nitrogen now is from octet. So in this diagram, the cross is from from the nitrogen, dot is from the hydrogen. Okay, so you can draw like this, or with the electron shaft or the orbits. It depends on you. Okay, C, part 1. So just fill up the oxidation number for the nitrogen. Nitrogen. Okay, so for this NO2, we know that oxygen is negative 2 times 2 is negative 4. This molecule is neutral. Nitrogen must be positive 4. Okay, for HNO3, we know that oxygen is negative 2 times 3, negative 6. So hydrogen is positive 1. Okay, so therefore, we know that nitrogen is positive 5 now. For NO, we know that okay, oxygen is negative 2, N must be positive 2. Okay, so from here, we know that the nitrogen okay, is going to oxidize and reduced from positive 4 to positive 5 is being oxidized positive 4 to positive 2 is being reduced because okay, it gains one electron okay, from positive 4 to positive 5 it gains two electron from positive 4 to positive 2 okay, so now explain part 2 explain why the reaction is state 3 it described as disproportionation reaction include reference to transfer of electrons so means you just need to mention which one is lost which one is gained right okay so nitrogen in the NO2 undergoes oxidation and reduction okay, so this one is what you need to state so why the nitrogen now is undergo oxidation and reduction based on electron transfer? Okay, so we know that NO2 to HNO3 it's involved loss of electron, loss one electron. NO2 to NO involved gains of electron, okay, gains two electron. Right. Okay, part D. The release of nitrogen monoxide in the atmosphere caused atmospheric pollution. State and explain the effect of monoxide, this nitrogen monoxide, in contact with the moist air. Okay, this one is uh, very easy. So you need to know nitrogen monoxide. Uh, it's easily oxidized to form nitrogen dioxide. Nitrogen ox dioxide further oxidized together with moisture to form the HNO3. Okay, but the, this HNO3 is not really the acid rain. The acid rain is 
caused by NO2 because this is a catalyst to form the SO3. SO3 with water will form H2SO4. That one is acid rain. Okay, so this one is just for your info how to make this nitric acid. NO2 with water with oxygen form this nitric acid. Okay, part E. In stage 3, nitro, nitrogen dioxide when it react with water, uh, it will form HNO3. This is another way. Okay, when this HNO3 form, then it will form another byproduct NO. Okay, after that, the HNO3 that form will further react with the ammonia from the ammonium nitrate. This is the fertilizer. Okay, in this question, you need to calculate the volume of NO2 that needed to form 40 tons, 40 tons of the ammonium nitrate. Okay, so first, you need to calculate the moles of ammonium nitrates that form. Okay, get the molar mass, so it's 80. Okay, after that, find the mole. Okay, 40 tons, you have to convert to gram. So times 1000, times 1000 again, you get the gram. Over 80, so you get this. The mole is this, 500,000. Okay, after that, you have to uh, use the mole ratio. We know that the mole ratio between this ammonium nitrate and the HNO3 is 1 to 1. Means this, the mole that we calculate here is same as the mole of nitric acid. Okay, then we know that the nitric acid is in the 3 to 2 mole ratio with this NO2. Means 3 NO2 will form 2 HNO3. So 3 to 2 mole ratio. Therefore, when we want to get the moles of NO2, we must use the larger ratio, which is 3 over 2. So means we just use the mole of the ammonium nitrate times 1.5 or 3 over 2. Okay, so you get the moles of NO2. After that, you can calculate the volume. Because it says that room temperature, so you just use the molar volume. Okay, times the moles of NO2. So you get this answer. Okay, must be in, uh, not really must be in DM cube. Okay, you can put in DM cube. Okay, state one use of ammonium nitrate very easy, always as fertilizer. That's all for this question. Thank you.